All right, welcome to Tuesday, 13 October. I'm glad you're back with us. Let's go ahead and get started and take a look at what we have planned for today. All right, these are our slides. Okay, Tuesday, October 13th. On this day in Texas history in 1845, voters here in Texas vote almost unanimously to accept the annexation of Texas. Annexation means to become a part of something bigger. Okay, Texas became part of the United States. Okay, They voted to become part of the United States, and they were more than welcome to join the United States. All right? It would... The... Uh, yeah, the uh, Texas voters, they voted. They said, we want to be uh, part of the United States. And they did. All right, so what was the primary reason for the Mexican Revolution? Okay. Why? There are multiple reasons for the uh, revolution, but the main cause was inequality. They remember the, the pyramid, the caste system that Spain had. It put the pure bloods at the top and slaves and mixed bloods at the bottom. They finally became unhappy and they rose up and they overtook the government and Mexico became a free country. All right. If you have any questions, please let me know. Send them to me so that I know, uh, so I can help you out. Now let's look at Schoology assignment today. Mexico becomes independent. All right. You're going to have three different slides, super easy slides. All right. Mexico becomes independent. Slide one, you're going to define each word and insert a picture that you feel best supports the word. Slide two, move the description next to the person's name that it describes. And slide three, use the links to fill in the timeline. All right. So you're going to come in here and in slide one, you're going to look for a definition for independence, constitution, federalism, centralism, republic, and social hierarchy. All right. You're going to fill them in right here. And then you're going to place an image. It doesn't matter how you look for the image. You can find it on Google. I mean, and yeah, Google, and then you can copy and paste the picture. Do not copy the link. You will get points taken off. If you copy the link, you will get points taken off. All right, slide two. Super simple. You're going to take this word box, and you're going to decide who does that represent who does that sound most like you can find out there who they are by coming up here and looking at these different links there's father miguel hidalgo gutierrez de lara gutierrez and mcgee expedition and eat derby day okay. on the last slide you're going to use these links to fill in the questions for the timeline. All right? El Grito de Hidalgo. When did that occur? Put the date in here. Describe what happened and what was the outcome. Battle of Medina. When did it occur? Describe what happened. Who won the battle? Eat Thirty Days Plan. Describe the articles in your own words. And lastly, the Mexican Constitution. Okay. When was the Mexican Constitution passed? Why did Mexico feel they needed a constitution? And how was this constitution similar to a Derby Day's plan? Ladies and gentlemen, that's it. That's all I got for you today. Remember, this is the final week of the grading period. Please turn your items in. Please turn your stuff in. Wednesday is the last day. Wednesday is the last day. Thank you guys. Have a wonderful day and I will see you next time.